I don't want to build any farther this way because I don't want to get in the way of the nuclear waste. Let's build another one of these because, yeah. Yeah, I don't know if she'll be done in time. I mean, we are doing pretty okay on food. Shit, that's what I forgot. Yeah, I'll just build it right here. I would like some water storage. <laughs> Okay, so people should be... There should only be one person left in the tents. Yep. Okay. Or the emergency shelter. All right, let's look at what our other options are. Forester, probably still not necessary because we still have a bunch of planks laying around. So yeah, we'll just let them keep collecting. All right. Yeah, it's funny. I end up in this game taking more damage from the dangerous, hazardous scavenging areas than I do actually fighting. Okay. What's next? Got a nice surplus of clothing. That's good. Okay, yeah, I need to put somebody here just to be prepared. Nice. Okay. Ah, yes, tools. What makes the tools? I imagine... Oh, tool shop. Well, doesn't that make sense? <laughs> I should probably... I was going to say I should probably put this next to the recycler. But that doesn't actually make a difference. Or the scrapper. He needs to be close to the warehouse and the raw supplies. So I think I will put him here. Because then he can get the metal from here make the tools and then just drop them off at the warehouse there. I feel like that should do the trick. Magnetic storm. Energy production shuts down. Earn uh, buildings producing or consuming energy might be damaged. Oh yeah, no, I don't have electricity. <laughs> this doesn't affect me. <laughs> Ain't that a bitch? That's how, how it works though for me right now. Commotion in camp. Someone's yelling inside a tent. Man, what's your problem? Suddenly, muffled cries for help are coming from one of the shelters. You rush in to look what's going on. Instead of a colonist, you find a large hole in the middle of the floor. The shelter was apparently built on top of a small sinkhole, which gave in and swallowed one of the inhabitants. A makeshift ladder should help getting the colonist out without injuries. Sure, I'll build a ladder. Part of me wants to tell him just climb his ass out because we don't have unlimited resources, but hey... Let's try to keep them happy. Good lord. He's not getting very many at a time, is he? Either that or there's just a ton of the bastards in here. Hey, uh, where'd you go? Lady, where'd you go? We are nowhere near food capacity. Hold up. Did my people eat all my corn already? Where the hell are you guys keeping the corn? have another yeah you do that is probably a very good idea
No free carriers left. Well, if this individual <laughs> would stop being injured. No, nah, I know. She's, that's actually the doctor. Never mind. Okay, I need a carrier, so I'm going to let you free. Yeah, I'll send this guy home and we'll start looking for research. Oh, yeah, I guess I really don't need tools right now, do I? Uh, I guess you're right. You know, the game notifies me when somebody's injured. That is a good point. Ah, it still doesn't do that, huh? I wish it would do that. Where... If I give him a multiple turn move order, I wish he would just bloody do it. Without my... Okay, there, well, there we go. Hey, Ella? It's open. Stop arguing with some random dude in the street. Good lord, if I had a broken bone, I wouldn't just sit there and argue with a dude in the street. I'd go to the doctor. <laughs> Even if I am in the U.S. and a broken bone could potentially bankrupt someone. Okay, it's not that extreme, but it's still pretty bad. <laughs> All right. Okay. Let's check this area out. And yeah, we'll look for research. Hey, look at that. Good call. It's right here. Yep. Come on. 8% and then I can move your ass to a more useful job. Okay, go to a more useful job. Next. Yep, rage magnetic storm, it don't do shit to me. I'm doing all right here, how about you? Get me the research. That's 200 research. Let's go to the tech tree. Nuclear waste storage. Ah, environmental station. Isn't that going to require electricity? I mean, I do want to get rid of all the radiation. That is always a big goal in this. Okay, so we have 100 left, and he's going to go to that one more time. Oh, yeah, we can definitely get the radiation cleaning. I love that this axe is actually hitting my tents, and it's like, yeah, we don't care. And nobody here have electricity. So yeah, I also need to go down the power route. Okay. Like, I know I don't have any. Hey! More people to do work. I'm sorry, do we have a voodoo priestess now? Her senses were honed by pure necessity as she guided her family through the newly formed wasteland. Her motherly instincts, instincts drew her to look out for every possible threat. And apparently her, you know, pet spirits, because holy crap, lady. Well, we have another injury. Three deposits depleted. Okay. Hold up, game. <laughs> I need to see where these deposits are. Let's start hitting these ones up. Okay, 
cool. Okay, I'm gonna let him keep regetting this. Oh, he's not ready. You know, I like to move them all at once, so I'm gonna wait till he's ready before I give her orders. I hate that they have staggered movement like that. So she can just chill for now. Oliver is now an adult. Get to work. There we go. Unless they fix that thing with the specialist, because I remember before it was a setup where you know, it was a set amount of time between them, not a uh, what's it called? You know, you couldn't step you. They were staggered, basically, and I did not like hopping in and out of that damn screen. I feel like I'm going to need a forester here pretty soon. I didn't realize that would do that. I think we're good on how... Well, no, we do need another tent, don't we? Also, research. Hmm. Requires energy to function. I could do both. So let's do both. Let's research energy production. And hazmat engineering. So we can start cleaning this shit out. Because I would love to expand this way and this way, but I cannot. Okay, how much does it need the hazmat engineering? Or the environmental? So it doesn't get rid of it entirely. It just cuts it down and still needs to store it, right? If I'm reading this correctly. Do I have nuclear storage? To relative safety, okay. So I need this. Well, it says I already have the storage. question is, is there a way to eradicate it completely if I go too far? No. Just what I have. Okay. That is still better than just leaving giant pools of it outside. Energy storage is, I think, the next one I need to get. Uh, should I just put this, like, all the way over here in this wasteland? Be like, hey, yeah, that's where we're going to store the pollution. <laughs> in this little hollow over here. Hey, guys, just don't go into that valley, all right? It's fine. Just don't go into that damn valley. I mean, realistically, that's what you would do, right? Especially the whole out of sight, out of mind thing. I don't know why I clicked on that. But we need 12. Requires more maintenance. Ooh, I don't like that. Oh, we also don't have any parts. Okay. So I'd have to do solar panels. Well, since I can't really fit anything right here. Might as well. I'll throw all three of those down. What deposits got depleted? Good God, guys. You guys are killing the natural resources. I'm gonna need a new stockpile soon, too. I think I'm gonna move it this way because I need more planks and stuff. Okay, let's get these built first, and then we'll focus on everything else. All right, you. Go get me tools, I guess. Well, let's continue exploration, actually. Okay, metal is always welcome. 
plastic is always welcome. Oh, God. What the? F well, that's lovely. <laughs> kind of lost track of this. Yeah, guys, you guys want electricity? You get to this. We might want to... Oh, small group at the gate. What you want? A ragged bunch shuffles slowly toward the gate. Their clothes are torn and dirty with traces of dried blood. One of them pleads. Our caravan was torn to shreds by effing bandits. I might have been those bandits, honestly. And we got no place to go. Could you please help us? We'll give every little bit we have left for some medicine or shelter. I mean, I'll take four more colonists and... I mean, I do have a medic. The group is frankly surprised by your offer, having little words to say aside from thank you. The injured are advised to seek the medic immediately. There. You know, I think I'm going to double up on doctors because I think they had four wounded. Oh, and we got somebody that's infected. Great. <laughs> okay, we got that done. So let's build the environmental station yeah we need this we need the housing too because we have somebody homeless now we do holy shit oh well i guess we're gonna keep going i guess we could build start building towards the gate i mean there is no reason to you know put distance between us and the gate I mean, logically, I wouldn't want to live near the gate just because anybody get attacked, it's going to happen there. Can we go back to the specialists? Here's what I need from you. Research would be nice. You know, what? I'm going to do a little bit more exploration. Ooh, we need that too for the turbines. What is this? Oh! Are there non-hostile factions now? I'll be damned. I didn't know that was a thing. You couldn't explore that? Fine. Yep, we're working on the tents, and we're working on getting you guys not infected. Okay, nobody's homeless now. Good God, how much? How long do you got to treat this person? Get them to work, damn it. Okay, let's see. I really want to get my environmental station working. I don't want to build it here because I feel like that's where I want to be. Oh, good God. Eek, I don't know. Where's a good place to build this? I mean, there is a lot of nuclear waste over here, maybe in the middle of it all. I know it's going to have work zones. I don't want to build it here because, you know, trees. Yep, I know. I got to build the environmental station. I got the power and I got to build the storage. So I think I'm going to build this here. Because there's a lot of nearby areas. And then we need nuclear storage. And like I said, just for pure role-playing perspective, I feel like <laughs> this would make the most sense. It's like, yeah, it's all the way over there. Just all the way over there. Wouldn't be efficient, I know. But I kind of want to do it anyway. <laughs> I 
I know, it's not efficient, but realistically, that's what we do. With nuclear waste storage right now. I'm gonna go with one building at a time, though, because... Ugh. I'm probably gonna need tools. You're saying I need at least two of them? Okay. Okay. 